Door County gets a couple million visitors a year. And on a trip here, before, long before we opened, it occurred to me that they didn't all want to have fruit wines, all those people. And um, by the time we returned from Door County to Milwaukee, I had my business plan pretty well written. And that business plan never included doing any fruit wine. We don't pattern ourselves after any specific winery or any specific winery's winemaking style. We like to barrel age in uh, all of our wines, with just a couple of exceptions, because it really does change the impression of, uh, on your palate. And it adds uh, a flavor profile that one can't get from stainless steel tanks. This is too much fun to try and shorten the process. When our grapes arrive from California, whether it's 3 o'clock in the morning or 3 o'clock in the afternoon, after about a 36-hour ride from California, whatever time they arrive, we start crushing and we don't stop until we finish crushing whatever has just arrived. We produce um, the usual suspects. We produce Chardonnay, we produce Merlot, but our Merlot, for example, is uh, from the oldest Merlot planting in the state of California. It's old vine Merlot. Um, the vines are now 51 years old. They're planted on their own rootstock, and our specialty is trying to find unusual grape varietals uh, or finding unusual examples of, that, of a grape, as in an old vine Merlot. We make Zinfandels, we make Barbera, we make a wine called Grignolino, uh, we make a couple of Cabernets, we make a Viognier. We call ourselves a Calital winery, California-influenced but primarily influenced by Italian wines. I love wine, and I've loved it for years. I started out drinking it as a kid, swiping it from my father's wine cellar. 